Hi everyone, welcome to Podcast with Maria, the show where we explore more about women and how to improve maternal health. I'm your host for today, Mara Yusuf in the house, representing MC 2424A and with the collaboration with IPRMSA UITM Malacca Chapter. And each week, we dive deep into every woman's stories, from inspiring stories to expert insight. We've got it all! So, buckle up and join us in this journey. This is Podcast with Maria, where the topic for today is Hello, Mommy to be! Let's get started! Aha! What is so special is that there is no guest for this week. Let's dive in this topic with me, your personal woman health medical assistant, Maria Yusuf. Embarking on the journey of parenthood is an exciting adventure that begins even before conception. In this podcast, we delve into the essential element of preconception health, setting the stage for a joyous and health pregnancy for both partners. Aha! Before you see those two pink lines on a pregnancy ties, your diet plays a crucial role. Picture your plate as a canvas filled with a rainbow of nutrient-rich foods. Fruit, veggies, whole grains and lean proteins become the building blocks for a healthy start. To all mommy to bees out there, remember maintaining a healthy lifestyle is not just about fitting into your favorite jeans, it's about creating the best environment for your future family. Say no to smoking, limit your alcohol and steer clear of licit substains. Exercise become a shared activity not just for fitness but as a boost for fertility. Hmm, woman, pregnancy is not just a physical journey, it's a mental and emotional one too. Stress, if left unchecked, can impact fertility. Create a space for open communication and emotional support between your partners. Explore every simple stress management like mindfulness and relaxation to keep the mental seas calm. Aha! You think the woman only need to take care of the pregnancy? No, no, no. Hello, man. Your role in the journey matters too, okay? Okay, so now I want to give an advice to all gentlemen husband out there. Today, we are shaking things up because of you. Yes, you. You are a crucial part of the pregnancy journey. It's not just about being a father, it's about being an active partner and supportive teammates. Let's dive into why your involvement is crucial. Ha, husband, remember, you are not just spectators in this journey, you are an active player. Your support and involvement during pregnancy make a significant impact, from attending doctor's appointment to helping with cars. Your role is a vital as ever. Embrace the journey because, trust me, you are an integral part of it. Okay, okay, okay. Now let's talk about being a good spouse during pregnancy. It's more than just bringing pickles at midnight. Although that is um, appreciated too, but it's about understanding mood swings, being patient with your wife and offering a listening ear. Mm-hmm, not just that. Please, 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 please bring your preggy wife for a holiday or catching up sunset on the sea. Wow, that was so amazing. I wish to be treated like that too. That will bring so much happiness for the woman. Trust me, I'm a woman too, so I know the tips. <laughs> Okay, okay, let's back to the serious tips. Man, your involvement goes beyond emotional support. Participate in decision making regarding the health of the woman you love. From discussing healthcare choices to planning for the birth, your input matters, okay? Being part of these decisions ensure that you are actively contributing to a healthy and a positive pregnancy experience. In this journey, do not leave your wife, okay? Do not leave your wife making decisions alone. It's a very, very tough journey for her. Always be by her side, okay, gentleman, husband? <laughs> this is a tips for you. 
Okay, now ladies, this is specially for you. This one is a special tip for all preggy mummies. Whether you are planning for a family or you are already a mom or just like navigating a life, seeking care is very very crucial. Prenatal, postpartum and regular primary care, they are like the triple pillars of women's health. Don't you ever skip them, they are your toolkit for a healthy journey. Alright, now let's discuss on how to steer clear of common complication. This can affect both the health of the expectant or the new mother and their precious little one. Oh my god, we really need to avoid this. Let's explore why is it essential to be proactive in reducing the risk. As all of us know, pregnancy is a remarkable journey, but it do comes with a challenges. Complication can range from physical to emotional disorders that impact the well-being of both the mom-to-be and the unborn child. It's like navigating through a sea of possibilities, and today we are focusing on how to avoid these tummy waters. Aha, the good news is there are steps that you can take to minimize the risk. It's not about eliminating every uncertainty, but about reducing the chances of complications. Think of it as putting on a safety belt for the journey ahead. Taking the simple yet effective measures to ensure a smoother ride for both mom and the baby. Mummies, you really want to know what is a step? Okay, let's dig in. First and foremost, maintaining regular prenatal care checkups is crucial. These check-ins allow healthcare professionals to monitor the well-being of both mom and the baby, catching any potential issue early on. Ensuring a balanced and nutritious diet is another key factor. A well-nourished body is better equipped to handle the demands of pregnancy. Well, we will explore the importance of specific nutrients and dietary choices that contribute to a healthy pregnancy. Yay! Moreover, we will delve into the significance of regular, moderate exercise during pregnancy. Physical activity is not only promotes overall well-being but can also alleviate common discomforts and prepare the body for labor. So, make sure you always do a jogging, exercise and go for a gym. That's good for labor, okay? We will also discuss the role of stress management and mental well-being during pregnancy. Strategies to reduce stress not only contribute to a healthier pregnancy, but can positively impact the baby's development. Ha! Ah, attention to all beautiful mom-to-be! Pregnancy is a journey filled with a real wine of emotions and each moment of it is a step closer to meeting your precious one. Hmm, can't wait to see either it is a boy or girl. But please, please, please don't cry so much during your pregnancy. It will affect your little one. Poor your baby. Hmm. In those tough times when hormones are on a roller coaster and the world seems a bit overwhelming, I know it is very very tiring for a preggy moms out there. But try to sit down, take a deep breath. You are doing an incredible job, yeah, you did it. And it's alright to embrace the ups and downs. The excited feelings of the upcoming adventure and the joy that your new bundle of happiness will bring. You've got this pretty mom. So wipe away those tears, stand tall and let's navigate this journey together. Because you are strong, you are resilient and you are creating a beautiful beginning. Ah, remember, it's about empowering yourself with knowledge and practical steps. Join us on this journey as we explore this simple yet effective measure to create a supportive environment for both you and your baby. 
In conclusion, dear, knowledge is your ally in this journey. By understanding pregnancy complication and actively trying to reduce your risk, you are taking charge of your well-being and that of your little one. Here's to a healthy, happy and complication-free pregnancy. Until next time! Looks like we are already at the end of the podcast. That's a wrap on today's journey to a healthy pregnancy. Remember ladies out there and mummies to be, understanding and reducing the risk of complication are your superpowers. Until next time, stay informed, stay well and here's to a beautiful adventure ahead. Take care my ladies out there. See ya on the next episode on Podcast with Maria. Bye-bye. See you later.